Welcome to Get Styling with Liz. Peppermint's joining me today, and we're here to unbox an Authentic Books. Authentic Books is a really fun book subscription. It includes lifestyle products, and they go across the senses. So sight, sound, touch, taste, and smell. It's really fun. The sight item every month is, of course, your book. And then for smell, you get a hand-poured candle. And for taste, you get drinks or treats. For touch, you get self-care items like lotion. For sound, you get a Spotify list that goes with the book you've chosen. So it's really kind of a neat thing. There's two different subscription options. There's the Deluxe, which is $66.99 and $5 shipping. And that includes gourmet chocolate, one to four touch items, a candle, your drink choice, so you can choose between coffee, tea, or a cocktail mixer, the Spotify playlist, a bookmark, your book plate, and of course your book. And then there's the standard box, which is $56.99 and $5 shipping, and that includes two touch items, your candle, drink choice, Spotify list, bookmark, book plate, and of course your book. If you're interested in checking out this subscription, I do recommend it, and if you use the code LIZ10, you can save 10% on your first box. All right, let's get to the unboxing. Comes in a box like this. When you open it up, this is what it looks like. So first thing I'm pulling out is my pamphlet. It does show my book title on the top. And did you see that peppermint just stole crinkle paper? So inside your pamphlet, it does tell you the items in your box. Pepper, stop stealing the crinkle paper. She's crazy. She loves crinkle paper. All right, first item I'm pulling out is a little pouch. It says, Love Real. Has a zipper on the top, just to, out of a canvas type material. Next item I'm pulling out is my bookmark. And on the back, it has a quote from your book. And it says, Love was actually real. Truth is, if you looked hard enough, and didn't die from the disappointments along the way. The real thing was out there. Happily never after. All right, then I'm pulling out my gourmet chocolate. It's raspberry with 70% dark chocolate. That looks yummy. And another taste option is, uh, looks like I got a can of tea. It's white tea, peach, and lavender flavored. So sometimes you get loose leaf tea, some you get times you get tea bags, sometimes you get cans of tea, lots of different options. You can also choose coffee or like I said a cocktail mix. So and you can choose to be surprised and so I might do that so that I can get different things every time. The only thing is I don't have a coffee maker. We use a Keurig so the coffee might go to waste. That's why I haven't done it yet. All right next item is a candle. And this says, not a fairy tale, strawberry and coconut milk. Sounds pretty, just has a standard wick. All right, the next thing I'm pulling out comes in this pouch. Peppermint, you cannot have the crinkle paper. She really loves the crinkle paper. It's a body fragrant mist with scent notes of light lavender and crisp water. Cool. All right, then by Face Tori, a face mask. It's a collagen face mask. That's nice. I always love a good face mask. My book plate, signed by the author. And then my book, so happily never after. Their name, the objectors, their job, to break up weddings is hired. Their dilemma, they just might be in love with each other. When Sophie Steinbeck finds out just before her nuptials that her fiance has cheated again, she desperately wants to call it off. But because her future father-in-law is also her dad's cutthroat boss, she can't be the one to do it. Her savior comes in the form of a professional objector 
whose purpose is to show up at weddings and proclaim the words no couple usually wants to hear at a ceremony. I object. During the anti-wedding festivities that night, Sophie learns more about Max and the objector's job. It makes perfect sense to her. He saves people from wasting their lives, from hurting each other. He's a modern-day hero, and Sophie wants in. Their two love cynics start working together, going from wedding to wedding, and Sophie's having more fun than she has had in ages. She looks forward to every nerve-wracking ceremony when they save the lovesick souls of the betrothed masses. As Sophie and Max spend more time together, however, they discover that their physical chemistry is off the charts, leading them to dabble in a hookup session or two. But it's totally fine because they definitely do not have feelings for each other. Love doesn't exist, after all. And then everything changes. A groom-to-be hires Sophie to object, but his fiancée is a woman who broke Max's heart. As Max wrestles with whether he can be party to his ex getting hurt, Sophie grapples with the sudden realization that she may have fallen hard for her partner in crime. Oh, that sounds really cute. What a unique story. I love rom-coms, and that sounds like a really super fun one. So that's my authentic books this month, guys. It was a fun box. I really enjoy this box. I love getting a book every month and all the little goodies. Again, if you're interested in checking it out, use the code LIZ10 and you can save 10% on your first box. Thanks for tuning in. If you haven't yet subscribed to my channel, please do so. If you have, thank you so much. I appreciate you being here. Catch you next time.